something you can't break down into smaller factors. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. six mm -hmm. is two by three. It's not prime. Seven, it's only one by seven. It's prime. We got that. Mm -hmm. Good. Prime numbers, mathematicians love them. They've always asked, gee, what's the biggest prime number we know? That we know there's an infinite number of primes. They go on forever. But at any given time, you can say, wow, what's the biggest one? Mm. We've just discovered a new biggest one. Let me tell you how it works. <laughs> Let's go back to about year eight in school. Two cubed is two times two times two. Mm. You with me? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That equals eight. eight. Got it. You can take away one. So two cubed minus one would be seven. Mm -hmm. That happens to be a prime number. Mm -hmm. And it turns out a, a, a really nice way to find primes is two multiply by itself some number of times, take away one. It turns out two to the power of 43,112,609 take away one. You get a number, it's almost 13 million digits long and these guys in the States have cracked it with a computer and proven that it is a prime number. If you typed this number out in like a textbook form, the number itself would go for thousands of pages and we know that number is prime as confidently as we know the number is seven.